Greetings. We're just here stopped off next to the highway along Highway 199 in Southern Oregon. Cutting our way up from the California coast back into Oregon. And we're here at the rough and ready area of critical environmental concern right next to the highway. And it's a little rest area with a kiosk. And it's a good chance since I need to stop off and fix a broken sandal. Yeah, I don't really want to stand on this ground. There's toilet paper and gross stuff everywhere and things. And so that will be a perfect chance to try out our freshly woven plastic bag mat. If you uh, watched our previ previous video, oh man, that traffic is terrible. This tailgate is rough and I don't want to sit on these bumps and things. So I think I'm just going to go ahead and roll it out. And uh, got my little sandal survival kit here handy. And that's, that's actually kind of nice there. All right, let's try it out. Oh, now that is a hundred times better than having to sit on that rough, bumpy tailgate. It's squishy, it's soft, and because it's a, it's a cold November morning, but it's black in color, so it's absorbing the heat from the sun. It's gonna start getting warm here momentarily. I can almost already feel, yeah, in the sun. Here, right there, that's uh, nice and toasty. Wow, perfect. I think it's a beautiful uh, spot here, other than the noise. And you might have noticed uh, another area of critical environmental concern. We took you on King Mountain, or was it King's Mountain? Gosh, I've been on a King Mountain and a King's Mountain. I can't remember which one now. But it's over near Grant's Pass. You just jump off of uh, I-5 near, near Wolf Creek, go up the mountain. But this is another area of critical environmental concern. You can walk up along here. There's the Rough and Ready Creek just right over here. All the highway coming right off the bridge there. But uh, that'd be a good chance to try out the little mat. And wouldn't you know it, it works out great. And uh, if you didn't see the other video, these are the tops of the plastic bags that we use for our camp toilet, the wag bags. There's another video you've always used to watch. If you, you see how that's done, the top of the bag gets cut off. And we just use the bottom, which cuts into two little sort of corners. And, you know, so each uh, big lawn bag turns into basically two wag bags. But then there's the whole top half of the bag that basically is waste. So, as you may have remembered, if you watch the video or go watch it right now, uh, we took those and tied them all end to end. So there's little, all the little knots. And then did a simple over and under tabby weave using a, a hanging sort of uh, loom or setup. Just in the little... Uh, RV trailer living room. There's enough space for it there But it's a really good way to keep some trash out of the environment not have to throw some things away and repurpose recycle Especially the plastics. I don't like having to use the plastics, but I'm um, not really uh, Able to use a composting toilet or anything like that at uh, the place that I stay when I'm off the road So I kind of have to do the wag bags and that's it's kind of terrible and sometimes you know, I'll do it on the road when there's a you don't feel like squatting in a hole necessarily. You want to actually sit down and so we'll use the camp toilet, you know, just to, for a little bit of comfort. You know, you don't always want to have to squat over a hole with the ants crawling up your legs. And speaking of legs, I think it's time to get on with fixing the sandal here. If you saw our previous video about sandal and quick sandal repair, got our little kit here and it's just going to take not even five minutes to get that cinch back together, get back on the road and cruise on farther up into Oregon. We want to thank you so much for joining us here right on the edge of Oregon, in Southern Oregon, along Highway 199, at the rough and ready area of critical environmental concern. It's a little wayside to take a look at our first trial of our recycled and repurposed plastic bag woven mat.